you're going to really like today's video. Okay, you can move to Luxembourg for free. Move to Luxembourg for free to work. Okay, that is why we are here. Move to Luxembourg for free to work. Isn't that amazing? So you're all welcome. Okay, so I see a lot of you are interested in Luxembourg. Obviously, I have um, on thumbnail, you can see that it's Luxembourg, okay? So yeah, there are so many job opportunities in Luxembourg and Luxembourg is the richest country in the world, you know, based on the GDP per capita and things like that. And salaries are really, really high in Luxembourg as well. So if you're looking for a country to go to work where you're gonna be paid very high wages for your work. So it's actually a good idea to move to Luxembourg. <laughs> so hello everyone, thanks for joining. If today's your first time of seeing me, my name is Jackie and you're welcome to the channel. Right here on the channel, I share information to help you move abroad for work, for studies, for business, investment, everything and everything. You know, I talk about all of that right here on my channel. So if you wanna move abroad, regardless of your situation, your age, your profession, you know, your education, qualification, whether you have a family or not, your budget, whatever it is, you're going to see information that is going to suit you right here on my channel. I talk about everything and I do realize that so many people can't move abroad because of finances, right? Not everybody has a big bank account. So I always bring those opportunities, you know, that you're not going to break the bank to make it happen. And to the glory of God, many people from our channel have moved abroad and I'm so happy about that. So if you want to move abroad as well, please stick to the channel, subscribe to the channel, turn on the post notification bell. So every time I come on, you would get notified and you get to join us, okay? Just like this live today, the people that came first were those that got notifications, you know? So hit the subscribe button beside the subscribe button you're going to see a bell icon hit the bell icon as well so that you'll be receiving those notifications and also check your phone settings that it is set to receive notifications as well okay because i noticed some people turn on the youtube notification like my channel notifications but their phone notifications are not enabled so do check that i see all those data you know on the back end so you're all welcome and to my returning subscribers you guys mean the world to me thank you so much for coming back you know i love you all love you all you know how we do it thank you so much you mean the world to me okay and if it's your first time please also let me know in the comments so i can welcome you specially i always love to do that just drop a comment let me know it's your first time here and I'm going to welcome you especially to the channel, okay? I love you already. Thanks for joining. And I do pray that you would find info on my channel that will help you, you know, in your migration journey. <clears throat> and if you feel like, you know, you can't really figure out what is best for you, please feel free to send me an email and I'm going to assist you, <clears throat> excuse me, with finding the right pathway for you. That is what I do. You know, so you can just book like a one-on-one -on -one consultation. We get to talk over a call and um, I hear your story and then I tell you what is best for you. Everybody can move abroad. Everybody and anybody. There is something for everyone. You just need to find it. You know, information basically is what, you know, keeps people behind. Even the Bible says that my people perish because of lack of knowledge. And knowledge comes from information, all right? And one more thing, okay, before we even go forward, if you want to make $1,000 every month passively, then I have the best business for you. This is an online business that you can do from anywhere in the world and earn in dollars, in pounds, in euros, you know, and it's really amazing and you make money passively. It's publishing business. You can become a publisher on Amazon KDP and you don't need to be a writer. You don't need to be an editor. All the books are put together already, fully formatted, public domain books, edited, ready to publish. So all you need to do is buy these books, this pack of manuscripts, upload them on Amazon KDP and they sell to a global audience. Amazon is the biggest e-platform e-commerce platform in the world with over 2 billion active visitors every month so the customer base is there already so you buy a pack upload your books on amazon and they sell to a global audience and they sell forever so the books you're going to be uploading today are going to keep selling every day every month every year you know as long as amazon exists and you get paid every month from doing this okay i started this years ago and i'm still getting paid 
every month my money comes in you know and it's really amazing it can help you to save money to uh, to migrate abroad and can also help you with your living expenses okay so Stackley um Stackley has put together the manuscript so you can buy this manuscript from Stackley already formatted edited just ready to publish you don't need to do anything to it okay it's ready to publish they have a pack of 300 books a pack of 150 manuscripts and a pack of 60 manuscripts you can buy anyone you can afford and start your business okay I started with 300 I did the highest and it's really been amazing like super super amazing you'll be blown away by how much you can make from that little investment that you're making just once okay just buy that and that's it and it comes with free training Stackley is gracious enough to put together free training to assist you to start and publish your book so you don't need to know anything about it Stackley has that training for you and I also have a personal KDP group I can add you to when you buy your pack of manuscripts so what you need to do is buy your manuscripts the links are in the description box right now or send me an email I'll send you the links and then when you buy your manuscripts let me know just send me an email that you bought your pack and I will add you to my KDP group if you're interested all right so that's it the occupations that are really really like in demand in um, Luxembourg at the moment are tech jobs, you know, IT jobs, healthcare jobs are in high demand, engineering are in high demand, um, hospitality is in high demand, tourism is in high demand as well, you know, so um, did I mention construction? Construction is in high demand as well, you know, so we have, um, and finance, oh my goodness, the number one booming industry in Luxembourg is finance. Luxembourg is the financial hub of Europe. Like it's fast becoming that financial hub because there are many uh, multinationals in finance that are in, in Luxembourg. So, so many financial jobs are in Luxembourg as a matter of, of fact. So, if you work in finance, Luxembourg is actually really good for you. Okay. So, um, let me just give you the list again finance, right? IT, healthcare, construction, engineering hospitality and tourism. That is not to say that if I didn't mention this, you can't get a job in Luxembourg. I'm just mentioning top ones, you know, the top ones where they have um, shortage currently, but you can still get jobs in other sectors as well, okay? I have a few, a few um, websites I wanna show you where you can get visa sponsorship jobs in. Okay, so I just wanna show you that. I did a previous video where I showed, you know, other websites, I wanna show more in this particular one all right let me show you more of it so there's there's one i shared in my last video which which was um i think jobs.lu jobs.lu i think that was that was a website so i got a lot of comments from people in nigeria and i think some other countries or could it be nigeria only people telling me they could not see the website so i don't know if the web if that website is blocked in nigeria or is it just a few people so let me know let me even show you that first okay so let me know in the comments if you can see this website just go to the web after this video okay because i have a lot to show you so just stay here first <laughs> later you can go check it out you know if you can see this jobs.lu okay i got people saying that they were unable blocking my face <laughs> i got people saying they were unable to to um see this website jobs.lu people in nigeria i don't know if other countries were affected by this but this is a very good website to go get visa sponsorship jobs so check this out jobs.lu i have three others to show you in this video but i just wanted to talk about this because i got so many comments from people saying they were unable to access it so if you can't assess it there's no point using vpn and all of that to try to assess it just leave it okay and use the others because if it's blocked for your country if you use a vpn to assess it when they still find out you're from that country they may still not move forward so don't bother yourself with things like that just move to the next one there are so many okay there are so many websites where you can get jobs so leave that one let me show you another one so this one is work in Luxembourg, yeah? So it's work in Luxembourg. So work hyphen in hyphen luxembourg.lu. I'm gonna drop it on the screen, okay? So you can see the, the link. So you can see here they currently have 140 1467 offers right now on this website. 
Okay. Yeah, and someone may be wondering, are you are these jobs for English speakers? Yes, they do have jobs for English speakers, all right? So three main languages are spoken in Luxembourg. Luxembourgish first, then German, and then French. So those are the three official languages in the country. So you would see most people speaking those languages. They speak Dutch as well and whatnot. Okay, yeah. So, you know, because they are in the center of many countries, so they are influenced by all the countries around them. As a matter of fact, they have so many, I would say most workers, you know, actually come in from the neighboring countries every day to work. They just come in by train, you know, and work in Luxembourg, then go back, you know, to their countries at the end of the day. You know, they do that a lot. So they are English speaking English jobs, you know, because especially these industries are spoken about, apart from healthcare, which, you know, they usually like people to speak the language, you know, every other, all of these other industries, they don't care what you speak, you know. So they're English jobs. And if you're working in IT, no one really cares, you know, like they're English jobs. That's just a summary of it all. So when you're checking, they will tell you which job, which language they're after you know, for the particular job. And if it's not the language you speak, you can just move on to the next one. There are so many jobs, job openings. So you can see here, 1,467. And you can see relationship manager, real estate financing, um, coordinator. Um, we have all of this, accountant, assistant payroll, data transformation analyst, senior quantitative analyst, data steward, senior tax officer. You can see there, I guess you can see the kind of <laughs> industries, right? Where do the jobs fall? So you can see that most, most of them are finance jobs. So if you're in finance, Luxembourg is the place for you. It's really the place for you. Okay, so you can go through this. There are so many pages, obviously over a thousand. 1,000, about 1,400 jobs. So there are so many pages. So you just go through them and then you know see the one you want to apply for let's look at this data scientist let's see what the details in here are <clears throat> excuse me um data scientist yeah so you can see here language required language let me let me bring this up can you see it english required language english you can see that yeah so that's to show you that these jobs are they have English jobs, okay? <clears throat> and um, they haven't saying without experience. Oh my goodness, but well, please have experience. If you're applying for a job from overseas, please have your experience because they can easily hire someone without experience next door. So for them to come all the way across seven seas, you know, you should have more value than the average person in the country, okay? So still put together a good experience in your CV. And yeah, speaking of CV, you know you're going to be applying for jobs, okay? So your CV is what they're gonna be assessing you with, what they're gonna judge you with, you know, because you're, you're not there. You're not there to plead your case and defend, you know, whatnot. So your CV needs to be, have, um, be a very good representation of your skills, your experience, and the value you're gonna be adding to the company. So ensure you have a very, very good CV before you apply for jobs, especially abroad, right? So the CV you're gonna you use to apply for jobs within your country cannot be the same CV that you're going to use to apply for overseas jobs. It just cannot be the same one, okay? So try to work on your CV, put together a very, very good CV. I have a CV review service, as a matter of fact, so if you're interested, you can do it yourself. I have videos where I taught how you can actually write your CV and cover letter. I will link it in the description box below, but if you still need my help to, you know, look at your CV for you, you can send me an email. All right, and I'll do that for you. So for the purpose of those watching this video, I'm gonna give you a discount on my CV review service. Okay, a little discount for 24 hours, just 24 hours. So if you're watching, you need that, send me an email. Let me know you need that discount just for 24 hours only. By tomorrow it's off, you know, so you can do that. Let me just do it for you guys so you can um, try to apply and get jobs, okay? So yeah, you can see here, <coughs> excuse me, um, all they need is a bachelor's. If you have a bachelor's degree and you have a little experience, let me not say without experience, as they've said here, because that should be from fully in, in the country. They can't leave because you're not the only one applying. Okay. So, this job, even when you don't have experience, you, you apply for this job, there will be definitely someone with experience applying as well. So, I don't think you're going to stand a chance without experience. So, just have experience. Okay. And then, description 
you know, we, we currently have a vacancy, you know, for a data scientist fluent in English. All right, so you can see that they need someone that actually does speak English. So requirements here, you know, they've talked about university degree in IT combined with relevant ITX professional experience of 13 years. So what did they say without experience in front? Up here, they put without experience. Whoever uploaded it made a mistake. Here they've said they need 13 years experience and in-depth knowledge of and experience in machine learning, deep learning, data science, blah, 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 and all of that and um <clears throat> excellent command of english language so english is like super super important you know to them right now so they need your detailed cv in english quoting reference so you have to have this reference you know when you apply for this job so always check how to apply to see the the you know the um instructions for application so you can be doing it the right way so all you need to do is click here to apply all right that's all you need to do. And um, I think I'm seeing more info here about how to apply and all of that. So, you know, it's it's for you to read. If, you're, if this is the job you want to apply for, you know, you go through all the details. This is for a data scientist, yeah? So that's just an example of one we just looked at. This was posted on the 2nd of February. And so it's still fresh here, all right? So this is just a random one I clicked on, right? So it doesn't mean that it's only data scientist jobs that are here. So there are so many. So just go through it and find the one that is for you, okay? So please give the video a like. If you're just joining us, please give the video a like and, you know, subscribe so you can be seeing more videos from me because I always, like, I do this, like, every day. I try to do this every day, you know, so that I can give you guys as much information as possible because there is so much, like, so much information that I have, you know, I've written like a list of things. Like I have a ca content calendar for like the next one month. I can come here and talk for the next one month and I will not run out of topics. I already have like a list prepared. So whenever you guys just recommend, you know, tell me the country you want to go to and things like that, I just will pull up that info and prioritize, okay, because that is what you guys are asking for. So it's very important that you drop a comment. <clears throat> very very important that you drop a comment so that i could know you know what you're interested in okay all right so let me get to show you guys okay the url for this particular one let me drop it on the screen so you can just go there and um, get the job or apply for the jobs and eventually get the job all right so yeah so that's it work in luxembourg.lu so please look at it very well work dash or whatever it's called work dash in dash Luxembourg <laughs> does all you okay so that's a link just just click that in you can actually click it right here in the live chat and go there directly or you type it out you know <clears throat> on your browser all right so that's the first one so let's look at the next one and the next one is my all-time favorite because most people from my channel that are put in jobs have gotten it through this website and it is indeed indeed is in like every country right and they all have different urls for the countries like the one for luxembourg now is lu.indeed.com so it like the uk will be uk.indeed.com you know things like that so the one for luxembourg is lu.indeed.com all right so when you come here you can search by keywords you know the job title you can search by skills you know when you want to search for jobs, don't search for one thing only. Try different things, okay? Always search with different things. For example, if you're a software engineer, for example, you search for software engineer. You also search for the skills in software engineering. <clears throat> Excuse me, like maybe JavaScript. You can search for JavaScript. Um, what else? You know, just things like that. So don't just... Um, you can even search for certifications as well. You can search by certification job title, job role, because there may be a job you qualify for, but they don't call that job software engineer. It could be something else. But the skill set they are looking for is the same with the skill set of a software engineer. You know, So that's just a tip for, for searching for jobs. You can search with different terms, the skills, the um, certifications, things like that. All right, so you can see more jobs. So let me just um, put in visa sponsorship here. I just search with that. 
So you can see jobs that have visa sponsorship. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you can see catering assistance here at PwC. Yeah, so PwC is in, is in um, Luxembourg. They have many multinationals there. Employee administration specialist. They have executive assistant, training coordinator, HR service center, you know, and all of that. All, all of this is with all these ones I've seen so far are uh, with this um, PwC. Let me see the details over here. Why is it? Stop scrolling. I want to unscroll. Oh, why is it not? I want this side to scroll to see details. Uh, okay, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, this, this is the info. Is the info for the, this job right now? <clears throat> Excuse me, what's up with my voice? What's up with my voice? So you can see this is a PwC job. It's PwC that is currently hiring for this position. All right, and um, they have visa sponsorship, meaning that they're going to hire you from overseas. Okay, so you can apply for this. <clears throat> excuse me they have an accenture in luxembourg as well because i know someone that got a job with accenture um which are there's there are many of them you know so you can just check you know all these jobs all right so moving on you can see kyc administrator business analyst business assistant marketing and communications coordinator associate client client data collection Sustainable construction engineer, IT security trainee, communication and project management trainee. You know, so many jobs here. And this is just one such term I put in. So you can put in anything. You can put in accountant, you, can, you know, whatever you're looking for. Let me just let me, let me do that. You can put in accountant at search. All right. So you can see them <clears throat> account payable accountants, junior financial accountants, accountants, junior accountants, 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 so many, you know, so many of them. So let's see um, healthcare. Yeah. So you can see it's showing me HR instead. <laughs> um, care, what do they call it? It's a caregiver, caregiving, care, care assistant. Let's see if we're going to get that sometimes this kind of job you need to be in the country already to get it it should be customer care assistant <laughs> care assistant okay health care assistant Add health care assistant <laughs> okay it's still showing me other assistants that are not healthcare. so whatever you need to use another search term to find that but you get you get the idea yeah you can search with different search terms to get the job that you're looking for so let me put um let me put the link right there so you can see it. So that's the link on the screen for Luxembourg Indeed. It is lu.indeed.com. Okay, lu.indeed.com. So let's see another one. Let's see another one where you can get jobs. And um, this one is niche down for for um what's it called? Well, let's see it. Eura, U, Eura access, e -U -R access .lu, you know, they are for researchers, you know, so if you need job in, so researchers, entrepreneurs, universities, and businesses, you know, put up their job, um, their job, um, what's it called, vacancies up here. So when I went through it, most of the jobs I saw were academia, things like that. Like you see this one, doctoral researcher in operations research, you know, um, doctoral researcher in labor economics. So people with a PhD or people that are in research, academia, lecturers, things like that, you know, this is where you can get a job in Luxembourg. You can see animal care technician, um, you know, all of that, all of that. I get I get emails from people that need this kind of job because these kind of jobs are hard to find. So I was so happy when I saw a in a website that has a niche down to this industry. Because these people really find it hard to find jobs like this. They have 70 listed here right now. So this is really cool. So if you're in this, you know, industry, research, academics, you know, business, entrepreneurship, this is where to go to. It's um, eurxcess.lu. Let me put it on the screen so you can just see it and go there and look for your job, okay? So 
Let me put that on the screen. All right. So that's it. That's um that's um the last one I just showed you now. It's um U E U R access with double S dot L U. So please check out these three that I've showed you, or four, depending on which country you're watching from. You could have three or four, you know, so you can check them out and then you know apply for these jobs when you have a job offer you then proceed to apply for your visa and then you move down to luxembourg okay that's how it works the visa processing for luxembourg is quite fast and you can get this done in you can get your your response in 12 days you know as little as 12 days it's not like it's fixed everybody must get it in 12 days it's not like that but as little as 12 days you can get a response you know to your visa application all right so let me take your questions real quick I hope you have questions please hit the like button if you're still here it means you like it be generous <laughs> and just support the channel by hitting the like button it's free you know it's free to do that and it means the world to me all right so please hit the like button i really appreciate it and of course subscribe so you can be seeing more videos from me if you found this one valuable then please subscribe so you can see more all right and please drop a comment I'd say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Anna, thank you. Thank you, everyone. Jude, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. God bless you all. Love you all. Subscribe, turn on the post notification, like the video, okay? Let's come out again and hang out tomorrow. Let me know in the comments what you want me to talk about tomorrow, okay? And I will be more than happy to bring you the content that you want because this channel is all about you it's not about me it's all about what you want so it's what you want i get to talk about so all right and if you need any of my paid services that is my email address up on the screen you can send me an email let's get to talk and let me see how i can help you to achieve your goals all right thanks for watching see you tomorrow love you all